Hello everyone and welcome back to a new episode of ILU Tutorials. In this video I'm gonna show you how you can use uh, shapes built in Adobe Illustrator in Canva. So we have this uh, Canva file of uh, 500 pixels cross 500 pixels and I've created a same file 500 pixels cross 500 pixels in uh, Adobe Illustrator and here I have three shapes with three different colors. One is this uh, greenish, the bluish and the reddish. So there are two ways you can uh, export these shapes into uh, Canva. One is just uh, export it as JPEG and then uh, upload it in uh, your Canva. Then there you can use it as a background and then you can insert icons etc here. And another uh, way is to export it as SVG and then you can uh, import it in your Canva file, upload it there and there you would have uh, an option to change its color. So that would be uh, too good if you want to do changes and just uh, make basic shapes here. So uh, one important thing here is that you keep the colors different of each shape. If you want uh, these two to be a, a, a similar color, then you can uh, match these colors and uh, take this one out and give it another color. But uh, it is recommended that uh, you give it a different color. So then you would have an option there on the Canva. To change uh, individual colors so now this file i will just export it as a jpeg first so i'm from my keyboard control alt uh, shift s so it would uh, give me this uh, uh, screen and from here i can just save it as png and let me save it somewhere okay i would just uh, save it in the document folder under a new folder ai2 can so I have uh, saved it here and now I'm gonna export it as SVG so uh, for that you just have to click on the file and uh, under here you have options export as so you can just click on export then export as once you click on export as you will have different options like here save as file type which file type you want to select so from here you can select the SVG now once you select the SVG and uh, let's uh, go to the folder uh, where we want to uh, save it so this is the folder I'm gonna export it and now uh, it is gonna ask me that uh, what do you want with the styling so you can uh, use the internal CSS so the color coding would already be applied and the font should be SVG so it should not be converted to outline if there is any font if there is a font you can uh, convert that to outlines too but I would recommend to add the fonts on Canva so there is no issue there and the images should be preserved or embedded so if you have used any images so now we are gonna look at this at the, from the angle where we just want the shapes or our basic shapes like we have a logo and we want to import it into Canva just to change the colors and give different options to the client so you can uh, keep these changes and from here just uh, click on OK and it would be exported now it has exported successfully now you go to my Canva so if you see uh, I have this uh, Canva file uh, 500 pixels cross 500 pixels you see and now I'm gonna just upload it here how you are going to upload it uh, in your Canva you can just click on the upload on the left once you click on the uploads here you would have an option of uh, upload files click on upload files you see I have also different uh, uploaded files too so I'd go to the folder uh, under this folder uh, I have uh, the AI to Canva file uh, folder where I have these two options so I'm gonna upload both of them the PNG format 2 and the SVG format 2 and click on uh, open so now uh, these are going to upload one by one so you see this one uh, with the white background is the PNG file and this one without any background is the uh, SVG file and the one with the background is a PNG file so I'm gonna look at both like first I click uh, on this one so it is up, uh, imported uh, here if I want to resize it I could resize it to the size of the artboard now it is uh, resized so you see we have these three different colors but we cannot change any of these colors like you see we have an option of edit image but we don't have any option like change its color etc so when is this option I would make another page here and now I'm gonna upload the SVG file here so I'm just click on the uh, SVG and now it is imported and I can resize it to the shape of the file or shape of the artboard and you see once this is uh, here you can also align it from here it's the middle align and also the centered align you could resize it too 
and now you could align it middle and center so now it is aligned you see we have these three different colors so it has already extracted colors from these three rings and now we have option to uh, ex uh, actually change it so for for example a client wants this blue a little darker so i could just uh, click on this blue and from here i would uh, go to the another shade of a blue like this one you see it has changed i could also change it to another color like for instance the uh, orange color you see it has changed the red one if i want to change i could change it i will first click on the red one and then i would click on for example this purple one so you see how these are going to be changed so this is how you are going to upload the png file and the svg file in canva and use it thank you for watching